Dilip Kumar began his career in the Hindi film industry in the 1940s, decades before it was known as Bollywood, and just a few years before the partition of British India. Born Mohammad Yusuf Khan in Peshawar in modern-day Pakistan, he was asked to change his name to Dilip Kumar when he began acting in films in the city of Bombay. Kumar wrote in his biography that the owner of production company Bombay Talkies wanted him to have a name that would be suitable for his audience. And so Mohammad Yusuf Khan became Dilip Kumar on screen, but remained Yusuf to those close to him. Should I be okay? Uh -huh. Kumar went on to be known by other names, Tragedy King for his roles in melancholic love stories such as Devdas, India's best method actor for his sincere performances, and the first Khan. A reference to his real surname and the three Khans, Amir, Salman and Shah Rukh, who were Bollywood's biggest stars for three decades from the 1990s. No actor can be bigger than the substance which he portrays. I mean the character, the story, the screenplay. And for any good or an enduring performance, Shah Rukh, you have to have a good story. Kumar won the Indian Film Industries Award for Best Actor a record eight times, including in its inaugural year, 1956. His 1960 historical biopic, Mughali Azam, where he played Mughal Emperor Jahangir, is the highest grossing Indian film of all time when adjusted for inflation. His talents were noticed outside India, but he turned down the role of Sharif Ali in the 1962 blockbuster Lawrence of Arabia, which went to Egyptian actor Omar Sharif. Kumar retired from acting in 1998, but not from public life. He was an advocate for the rights of disadvantaged Muslims. He travelled to Pakistan to receive its highest civilian honour, the Nishane Imtiaz, the only Indian to have done so. He served on the upper house of India's parliament in the early 2000s and received the country's second highest civilian honour for his contribution to Indian cinema in 2015. With his passing, India has lost the last actor from the era of Hindi cinema, which produced the first stars. Elizabeth Puranam, Al Jazeera, New Delhi.